Foxes are pretty cool creatures. They belong to the canid family and can be found almost everywhere except Antarctica. There are 12 different species and 47 subspecies in the true fox category of the Vulps genus. The red fox is the most well-known, but not all foxes are red. Some can be silver, white, black, or brown. They're a diverse bunch, with some loving the desert and others preferring alpine environments. Because there are so many types of foxes in so many places, they've developed a bunch of unique characteristics. It's like they've adapted to fit right into their surroundings, making them a fascinating bunch. Check out these eight awesome fox species that might not match the typical storybook image of a fox. Bat-Eared Fox Say hello to the bat-eared fox. This adorable creature, scientifically known as Otocian megalotus, earned its name because of its supersized ears. Why? Well, it turns out these big ears come in handy for locating insects and other tasty treats. This little fox has quite the diverse menu, enjoying harvester termites, ants, beetles, grasshoppers, spiders, and various invertebrates. And guess what? These insects not only make up its meals, but also provide most of its water intake. Living in the dry grasslands and arid savannas of Africa, water is a precious resource, so this clever fox has found a way to stay hydrated. But wait, there's more! Not only does the bat-eared fox rock those impressive ears, but it also boasts more teeth than any other fox or placental mammal. Talk about a unique and fascinating friend in the animal kingdom! Tibetan Sand Fox The Tibetan Sand Fox, Vulps ferulata, may have regular-sized ears, but it appears to have an unusually broad head. This is mostly because its muzzle is especially narrow, and it has quite a bit of thick fur surrounding its face. Its body is compact and its legs rather short, which altogether gives the animal a cartoon-like aesthetic. This fox is found at high elevations in the Tibetan Plateau, Nepal, Sikkim, and the Ladakh Plateau, sometimes above 17,000 feet. It hunts pikas and other rodents, woolly hares, and sometimes lizards. Cape Fox Meet the charming Cape Fox, Vulps Chama. This delightful fox calls Southern Africa home, hanging out in places like South Africa, Zimbabwe, Botswana, and the Kalahari Desert region. You can catch it strolling through open grassland plains or exploring semi-desert scrub. It's got quite the taste in habitats. To beat the heat, this clever fox takes daytime naps in cozy burrows, only to emerge and play when the night brings cooler temperatures. You might also catch a glimpse of it during the magical moments of dawn and dusk, adding a touch of gold to its adventures. When it comes to love, cape foxes are all about that lifelong commitment. They're the romantic types, sticking with the same mate for life. And here's a fun fact. These sweethearts can be parents at any time of the year. Even though they prefer solo foraging missions, you might not often spot them in pairs. They're like the stealthy solo artists of the fox world. Crab-eating fox. Let me introduce you to the adorable crab-eating fox, Serdotian thaus, also known as the forest fox or the wood fox. This cutie is a South American native and feels right at home in savannas, woodlands, subtropical forests, or riparian forests. Talk about versatility. Now, the name gives it away a bit. These foxes have a taste for crabs, especially those found on muddy floodplains during the wet season. But that's not all they munch on. Their menu includes crustaceans, insects, rodents, and even birds. What a varied diet. And here's a surprising tidbit. This charming fox is apparently quite the social butterfly and can be easily tamed. In fact, some lucky folks even keep them as pets. Who wouldn't want a cuddly forest fox as a companion? Fennec Fox Meet the charming fennec fox, Vulp Zerda, a true desert dweller that's mastered the art of surviving on very little water. This little adventurer is a night owl, keeping it cool in its cozy den during the scorching heat of the day and coming alive when the night sky takes over. What makes the fennec fox stand out? Well, just take a look at those admirable, disproportionately large ears. Not only are they a fashion statement, but they also play a crucial role in helping the fox locate its favorite snacks, which include reptiles, eggs, and insects. Plus, these ears are like nature's air conditioners, helping the fox cool off in the desert heat. Despite being the smallest canid species in the world, weighing in at an average of three and a half pounds and measuring around 12 inches in length, these little guys are full of surprises. Did you know they can jump two feet in the air from a standing position? 
Talk about impressive acrobatics for such a small package. Corsac Fox. Let's talk about the charming Corsac Fox, Vulps Corsac. In winter, these cuties boast incredibly fluffy fur that's just too tempting for poachers, making their populations face some tough times. These adorable foxes call the steppes and semi-deserts of Central and Northeast Asia home. Life in the wild can be a bit challenging for Corsac foxes. Natural disasters, harsh weather, especially chilly winters with lots of snow, poaching, and human development can cause their populations to drop significantly, sometimes up to 90%. But here's the silver lining. These resilient foxes are like nature's little superheroes. They have a knack for bouncing back quickly, which is why the International Union of Conservation of Nature still considers them a species of least concern. These guys are mostly night owls, spending their days cozy in burrows. And guess what? A fox might have several active burrows within its territory. Talk about a real estate mogul in the animal kingdom. Silver Fox. Let's dive into the fascinating world of silver foxes, a stylish twist on the classic red fox, Vulps Vulps. These unique foxes are born with a bit of extra melanin, giving their fur a darker hue with those eye-catching silver tips that add a touch of magic. Picture anything from all black with the classic white tip tail to stunning shades of blue or ashy gray. It's like they've got a natural shimmer that makes them stand out. Now, here's a bit of a twist in the story. The fur trade loves these silver foxes so much that they've been bred in captivity to the point of being domesticated. Yet, they've become quite the celebrities in the human world. In the wild, spotting a natural silver fox is like finding a rare treasure. It doesn't happen often. As they grow up, their eyes turn into a golden yellow glow, adding a touch of mystery to their look. These solo adventurers are semi-territorial, unlike their bark and howl-loving cousins, dogs and wolves. Instead of traditional barking, they communicate with a unique gecker or gipping sound, kind of like a chuckle during playtime or when defending their turf. What a charming bunch, don't you think? Arctic Fox. Say hello to the Arctic Fox, Vulps Lagopus, also known as the Polar Fox, White Fox, or Snow Fox. This fluffy friend has made the Arctic Tundra its cozy home, hanging out in the northern regions of Canada, Russia, Europe, Greenland, and Iceland. Unlike its desert-dwelling cousins who are all about the heat, this majestic fox is the true cold-weather champion. Picture this, it rocks the warmest fur coat of any animal in the Arctic, braving temperatures as low as a bone-chilling minus 60 degrees Celsius, minus 76 degrees Fahrenheit, like a total pro. But it's not just about staying warm, that pristine white coat also helps our Arctic fox blend into the snowy landscapes like a furry ninja. And get this, its tail doubles as a built-in blanket, making its burrow even cozier. Now, that's what I call smart and stylish survival in the icy wonderland. That wraps up our incredible adventure through the world of fantastic foxes. If you enjoyed learning about these clever, resilient, and downright adorable creatures, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the notification bell to stay updated on all our wildlife explorations. Have a favorite fox or a fun fox fact to share? Drop it in the comments below, we'd love to hear from you. And if you want more captivating content, check out our other videos on channel.